Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cheryl, all the way from Phoenix, Arizona. Today I'm gonna bring you part two of my great Goodwill finds. So without further ado, I'm just gonna go right in and show you what I found. Uh, if you haven't watched part two, go ahead and check that out. So I'm probably gonna, I'm not gonna release them on the same day. So this is part two of my great Goodwill finds. So go back and watch part one. Why not? I'm cool, right? I'm Cheryl from Cool's, Cheryl's Cool Videos. <laughs> Y'all forgive me. I'm, I'm just crazy. Uh, not crazy, crazy. Just fun. I'm just living life, okay? All right. So I'm going to go jump right into this haul, y'all. Most of this is glassware, believe it or not. I do have other stuff that I found at Goodwill. Again, this stuff wasn't bought on the same day, same store. So I'm just gathering it together and as much as I can and sharing it in a video. So let's go ahead and get right into this haul, y'all. Okay, enough of that. All right, so the first thing I want to show y'all, I don't know why I got this, but I thought it was cute. It's just this pumpkin pie dish. It was $2.49. 20% out because I use my coupon that I get every month from Goodwill. It has the recipe for pumpkin pie. I didn't get it for that. I really like this color and I got it because I don't make pies anymore, but I like pies. So during the holidays, if I purchase a pie, I can take it out of the, the what the uh, foil pan and put it in here and make it look more presentable, right? <laughs> right. All right. So I got that. Y'all, I also got this. Let me put my glasses on because I it's from Starbucks. But I got this cute Starbucks glass coffee. Let me pull the top off. I don't know about the straw, y'all. I don't know if I'm gonna use the straw. Cause it looks like this this has been used before, you know, looking under here. But yeah, I don't even know what size this is or anything. But it's glass. And look, you can see under here, if I have, have anybody watching from that collects antiques and stuff like that, $2.49. Like I said, I don't know if I'm going to use this straw, but I'm going to bleach this out really good and I will be using this. But yeah, I found this at uh, Goodwill. Like I said in my last video, I do watch people that shop at Goodwill and go to the Goodwill bins and all of that stuff. So I'm learning a little bit from them and I'm finding me some antique stuff. So I found this uh, Purex, it says since 1915. Uh, I can't really see the date, but it does say for microwave use, not for stove top. It says it in really small letters. I don't know if y'all can see that. But this is from Pyrex, and it was $1.49 minus my 20% discount. Yeah, I thought that was cute. I don't know what all this means. Oh, these have the ounces over here. But anyway, yeah, so I got that. I'm gonna have a lot of dishes to wash. Cause this stuff has just been sitting in bags. Um, so uh, I'm just trying to get the stuff out of these bags. I also bought this one. This is another, uh, and it doesn't look like this one had been used, um, but it's the first store Starbucks, 1912 Pike something, Seattle, Washington. It was 249. And I don't know if this is ceramic, it's not glass, but I was reading the bottom, I think it said, did it say it's microwave safe? I don't know. Y'all read it. <laughs> but I don't know. I thought that was cute. This is Starbucks too. So I got that. Yeah, I got this stuff in this, these papers. I don't know. I thought this was cute. It was $1.49. It's, it's probably not. What do people do? I see them. They be looking under the tags to see if it's signed. I don't think it's signed. 
yeah they be pulling the tags and look to see if there's if it's signed i guess by someone who made it but i like this because it's a ring holder it looks really cute and it don't have no cracks chips or nothing like that dollar 49 with 20 percent off so i got that i also found this little cutie patootie this right here is i think this is pyrex too but it was 99 cents let me look on here because was this pyrex i believe this is yeah it is it's pyrex also i don't know if y'all can see that on the bottom i can't see the year or anything like that but i'm seeing that pyrex is collectible so i don't see the year i watch a lot of uh thrifty divas videos because she goes and buy a lot of antique stuff and glassware and stuff like that and the niche lady and i know my channel is not big i have 107 subscribers and I love all 107 of my subscribers. I know that they don't all get to watch me every day and all the time. But I love them. So, if you have a channel, if you want me to shout you out in my videos, just let me know. I don't mind doing that at all. I also, in the last, in the first video, part one, I showed you guys a teacup set. Because I said I wanted to start being more dainty when I'm drinking my tea instead of drinking it out of big mugs so i have found this set here 249 i kept going back and forth on whether i wanted a plain white one so i went ahead and got it this is by gibson so i got that so it's a tea it's a teacup it's a little bit bigger than the other one but it's a teacup set so i got that you stick that right there i also got this cute little basket i have no idea what i'm gonna do with it 249 20% off. I have a bigger basket like this that I got to add, um, I think, DD's discounts a couple of years ago. It's just like this, but it's bigger. So that was 249 I also got this. I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with this, but I got it. It was $1.49. I'm assuming that it's, a, that it's a photo album. I haven't opened it yet. But yeah, so I got that $1.49. And let's see. I have a couple more things here. A lot of glassware. I got this for $0.99. Cents. I really like the color. It's like a mint green color. Um, I don't need no more mugs and stuff. This is by Hallmark. I just got it because it was cute. I think it says just another mug under here i'm not sure i'm gonna try to see if i can get the tag off so i can see what the top part says y'all bear with me i'm trying to see what the whole thing says it's not gonna let me be great does it say just hold on i'm almost there Oh, it says, yep. <laughs> Again, this was 99 cents. It says the word, yep. You see that? Yep, another mug or another cup. I thought that was cute. So I got that. I thought that it said uh, just another, but it says, yep, another. And I really love this. This was $1.49. I've already looked at the bottom. It said that it's microwave safe, dishwasher safe. I don't use dishwasher. Let me tell y'all about dishwashers and Cheryl. I didn't grow up using a dishwasher. These were my dishwasher or these. So, I mean, I'm not trying to come down on anybody that does use one to each his own. They're just not for me. I have a dishwasher here in my apartment and every apartment that I've lived in, I've had a dishwasher. I've never used a dishwasher because to me, I mean, this is just me. When you take the time to scrape the food out of the plates or whatever, and then you go to rinse it out, why don't you just, I just, I just feel like you should just go ahead and just wash it. That's just me. So these are my dishwasher. 
but that's just me. I have a dishwasher, but I've never used it. Never used a dishwasher. But anyway, I really getting back to this. Sing to the Lord for he has been good to me. And yes, indeed he has. And it even, I really got drawn to this because it also has a scripture in here. I don't know if you can see the scripture, but it says Psalm uh, 13, 6, uh, the new, um, the NIV. That's the new, I should know my Bibles. I'm a Christian and a minister. Uh, new international version, I think, is what it is. Don't get me wrong, but yeah. See the scripture? But yeah, I really like that, and I really like the cover. I mean, the color. And this is big enough to where you can put like some noodles or soup in here. So yeah, this is what I mean by not wanting to drink tea out of a big old mug. That's why I got the little uh, teacups. All right, moving along. I'm almost done with this, this second haul, y'all. This is just paper. Let me just look around. Yeah, so it looks like the only other thing that I have left in this haul, you guys, is this. <laughs> this thermometer. It's made out of wood. 99 cents uh 20 percent off and it has this little hanger where i can hang it so yeah so yeah so anyway i also just want to mention again i mentioned it in the first i'm just looking around to make sure it ain't nothing else i mentioned it in the first uh, uh part one of my goodwill haul that i'm going to be doing a giveaway soon but i'm going to be using these i'm going to draw names instead of using that i don't know i don't even remember what it's called I see other YouTubes, YouTubers do it. They get their computer and they let the computer uh, draw the names. I don't know how to do all of that. And I don't have a community page and all that too. And I don't have um, thumbnail stuff. So I'm just raw and uncut over here. So how I'm going to do mine, again, when I do release the video that tells you that I'm going to be giving the get, doing the giveaway where you're going to have to comment in the video. I'll put all the details uh, when it gets time, when it comes time for that. But when I see, and you're only going to be able to enter once, it's going to be on one video. Uh, I'm going to um, take your name from that video, from the comments section, and I'm going to write your name on one of these tickets. And what I'm going to do, I might do it on live. I don't know. I ain't never did live before, but I don't know. Because maybe I might have not, might not have a lot of people coming to the live. But Or I may just do a video showing you guys me drawing the name. It's going to be, if, I made my mind up. It's going to be for a $20 uh, gift card to Dollar Tree. So keep be on the lookout for that. I'm going to be doing my first giveaway. I have other things that I can give away but now times are kind of hard and sending out packaging stuff packages and stuff is so expensive now so I think this is the best way for me to show some support and love to my subscribers it's gonna be one winner so yeah no ties so yeah that's how I'm gonna do mine I'm gonna do it with raffles with these raffle tickets so with that being said I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here because I think I'm going to go ahead and, while I have the energy, film another Dollar Tree haul, right? All right. So if you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. That way you're notified each and every time that I upload a video. Until my next video, guys. My name is Cheryl, all the way from Phoenix, Arizona. Bye, guys. <laughs>